today we're going to try something different instead of doing YouTube um drawing like um how to draw and stuff or Roblox or my toy film I'm going to decorate this house. If we turn this around then you can open this up. I've had this for years. Yeah, and you can sort of like, it is meant to be a vet's house, but I just use it for anything really. Um, if you go on the side by here, you can lift it up and down, like a lift, but once it gets to the top, it's like a carpet. If you have a look in here, there's little cages because it's meant to be a pet's place but I can use it as a house and you can lock the gates open them and then the animal can go inside we go going to actually um yeah, we'll decorate this as a house and then maybe in the video I'll make it a pet shop like it's meant to be. I haven't got much house decoration, but I'm going to try and use what I have. So a bed would look good maybe in this room. I'm just looking for a person to live in this house. In my humongous box of toys. I just found this person. I know it's not the best. I will find a different one. But. But. Uh, oh. Um. Let me find another person. Because John Cena does not fit in the bed. Whee! I found this. Woman. Um. So. Um, she fits good enough if we put her feet like by here. Yeah. Looks quite good. Next, we're going to need to make a bathroom. Or at least somewhere where we can bath and shower. I've got this which we can use as a bath. Maybe up here now. Mm, we don't really have much space. But maybe we could put it by here. I've also got this mirror, which we can also put in there. There's a small bathroom. Now we need a sofa. We're going to put the sofa. Mm, we'll use that later. I feel like this could be a table. So maybe let's put it here. Or up here. Mm. Not as much room. So let's put it by here. This could be like a bench. Maybe. Let's try a person to sit on. Okay, let's grab her. And then put her on here. That looks good. Now we need food. But first, I'm going to put this little TV on the table as well. Actually, no. Let's get the sofa. And we'll put it by here. Put this here. And put the TV by there. Actually, I think the sofa's a bit too big, so let's take that out. Oh, I have a better thing for... The television stand again, so produce this basket. Actually, no, let's just go back to the original one, but definitely a new sofa. Maybe this could be like a washing basket. Let's put it in her room. I've got two slightly smaller sofas, but one's poofy, so maybe we could fit both in. Mm, I don't think we could, but maybe we could add this one 
Um, oh, and by here I put this bed because then, like, I found this in one of my boxes from a couple of years ago. It's a Rapunzel, sort of squishy, but more wobbly. It's a couple of years old from when I used to like it and she could be like a kid maybe and she could sleep in there uh, and maybe this could be what could this be hmm well we do need somewhere for a pet so maybe I think we can take these gates off but I don't want to risk breaking it. Um, oh, I took it off anyway. One second. Oh, I got it back on. I'm not taking that off because it was very hard to put back on. But it's working again. Maybe one of them could be for, uh, I don't know, like supplies or something. The other could be for a pet to go in. I think I use this as a pet bed, maybe. Or they could just have two pets, and, um, no, I think my first idea was better, actually, I'm going to take that out. Maybe this cushion for a pet bed, and then if we go over here, I got a pet bowl, I do have smaller ones, but let's try this one first. Ow, I just hit myself. Yeah, that seems good. Maybe put the stuff over in the corner a little bit more. I think that's good. I think they're going to own a dog because that's my favourite animal, Florence Loves Dogs. That's my YouTube channel. That's what it's called. So we'll put a dog in there. If it can fit. Oh yeah, it fits. Um, yeah, so now let's go in here. And I had some storage things. Put another person as well. So then they can be the parents of the kid. Um, right here. I also found another kid's bed exactly the same. So you can put it up there as well. Um, and then like... One kid could sleep here. Please don't fall, please don't fall. Oh, um, I could put this over there. This girl won't have much room, but it's fine. I just went a, through a bit more searching in this box and I found this sofa. And if we take this away, Maybe this could be the chair. And this could be a sofa. Sort of, it looks more like a sofa, definitely. It is meant to be a sofa. So, I don't think we need this anymore. Unless I could do something with it later. And I found this book. Where did it go? Um, there it is. It's got, like, My Little Ponies inside of when I really like My Little Ponies. So, maybe this spit area by here. I know it looks like a dog bed. Oh, yeah, that actually is a good idea. We could swap these around. So, this is the dog bed. I'm going to get a smaller dog now because I don't think this one will fit in the bed. See? It's too big. So we got this one, which is perfect size. So it's going closer. As you can see, you sat right in the bed. And if you want to get him out, open the gate. And then you can see him in the bed. And then when he's hungry or thirsty, you can go... And when he wants to play, he'll go like. I think I'm going to add a garden because I do have fence. 
Okay, it's gonna be like a cushion. And maybe, maybe this girl could sit down right here. And read a book. This book's upside down a second. Then, then she could read a book. Hope she enjoys the book. And then shut this by here and this. I think she's tilting a bit, but it doesn't have to be perfect. Oh, she fell. Let me just sort this out. I actually think now that this let's go back as a table. And I don't like this cushion anymore. We can put that. And hopefully she'll sit better. Get the book. Put it on her lap. Oh no, um, wait, if we, give me a second. Lots of trying, I managed to get her in and fit. I haven't tried opening the gate in the so. Perfect. And then maybe we can like go up here and watch some TV and then maybe she could be setting up the dinner table while this girl plays with the dog. Actually no. The dog couldn't be sleeping. And the girl could be having a bath. Okay, I'm just thinking anything else. Got table and chairs. Uh, okay, now once we now that we've done the outside, I think no inside I meant. Let's do the outside. But first Let's just pretend that they were in bed just to make sure that they all fit in the places. Like that. And then the girl, drop it back for a second. This girl's got a humongous head. Let me get a different person. I finally found someone who fit. It's Alex of Minecraft. And then she can sleep in this bed. Perfect. And this is the bathroom. And the pets in there. And I do not get why that won't go in. Oh, I think it's because of the dog bed. Let's turn it around. Perfect. Hopefully it not all shut. Perfect. And maybe the book can go on the table because it could be sat at the table reading as well. Okay, let's have a tour of room, all rooms. Let's take the two... Um, kids out, and the appearance, and the dog, and I'll give you a tour of their house. But first, we need to decorate the garden. I found some palm trees, so they look nice. Maybe one each side. And what I also found is this chair which like the youngest kid could sit on a high chair yeah um so let's put that inside okay i think let's put it by here let me just make sure i'm gonna get a different uh prison maybe this one and just put it in. She fits pr pretty well. 
Yeah, so let's take her out. I can't believe this video is already 15 minutes long. Yeah, um, I think I'm gonna um, move some bits around actually. So, if we push this out a bit and do the same with this. Actually, let's pull the bathroom in a bit more. But this could be here. So then there's more of them. Just like this. You go to the box. Oh yeah, that's all my teddies. A lot of teddies. And toys. Okay. So now we got that. Let's go back to decorating the outside. I have a really good idea. That sofa from earlier, I could use as an outdoor sofa. See, like, the padding here. Once we're done, I will give you a tour of the house as well. So then you know what I've created. I'm going to flip this bucket upside down so then it looks a bit like a table. Actually, no. I never had that idea by bucket. Um, I also have a car. Here it is. It's missing a door over here, but I'm sure that's okay. And it's four seats and it's four people. I think I'm going to park it in by here. And I decided this could be a sort of a table. I think I'm going to put fence around this area. This isn't a fence, but if, it's, if it isn't, then I'll just get some more. I've just started here. Okay, I'm done with the fence. And now, I'm going to give you a tour of the house. So, this is where you enter. And this is a car, so then you could drive out. And then when you go... And then, when you want to go back in, you just drive in. Like there. And you park here. Okay, then around here, you've got um, the outdoor furniture and a tree, and um, I got a bit closer view, and there we go, and then on this side, just got a tree, and then the car. Then you can open the door here one side but I just want to show you that you can also open these windows and then shut them open the doors this is an RSPCA animal hospital but I'm using it as a heist today and this is a balcony so then if you came out here from the house then it would be a balcony Let's go inside of the house. You go through here, and you'd come through by here. And if you chose to walk to the left first, there would be a mirror by here. Go inside. And the sink down here. So... Yeah, and then if you want, oh, and by here's the bathtub, and then when you go over to the right, um, got this bench where people can sit on. I'm gonna try them all sitting down at the table. I had to, to add this chair here just for now. Maybe we could put the high chair here and then the chair here just to make it sort of more like this. Then they all sit down for their meal. 
Do we got the parents sat on their bench? And the table. The little kid sat on her high chair. Facing this way. And then we got Alex of Minecraft sit, sat in her chair. Behind that. And here, the dog is eating some food while sat in her bed. Next to that, there's a little area to just relax. And then, uh, if you decide to go um, up here, you'd stand on here and then get lifted up. One second, we'll get by here. If you turn to the right, if you move these people at the bottom just for a second and move this in a bit, you can see that. Let me turn to here. You would end up here and you would walk across here into the bedroom. The parents sleep in there. And then like some washing and some stuff they need goes in there. If you turn over to the left, you could go onto the balcony which I showed you. And then shut the doors. Or if you needed a bit of fresh air, open the windows. But you would also come across sofa, which you can sit down on and watch some TV. Walk across here, and then there'd be two beds by here, where the two kids sleep. And that's the tour of the house. Um, I want to make this video really long, so now I'm going to remove all of the items in it and turn it into maybe well I did say earlier a pet shop and I bet some of you might have been excited so I'll just turn it into a pet shop I'm going to clean this place up the inside's now empty I'm going to go get some pet beds ok I've got a few um, beds um, we could put this one by here Maybe, and then I'll get some fence and put it by here. Um, and then maybe upstairs we could have this small bed. Or it doesn't have to be a pet shop, it could just be a pet area for pets to play. But I think I'm going to turn it into a pet shop. And here we could have a bed each in there. And then we need something to go up here. But also I have another bed for up here so then the pets can rest as well. I think this place is going to only be for dogs because I don't have many cat items. So let's get rid of that. I've got some dog toys. Like this chewy pillow. A little bone. And a ball for them to chase. It's actually an orange, but it looks like a ball. So, one, two, and three. I think um, I'm going to put a toy in all of the rooms. Let me just get one more because obviously we have a few. Actually, no... I think these are going to be toys for sale, so if you buy a dog, you have to buy some of these as well. I've got this till as well, so we can put that by here. And maybe we'll put some behind the counter. Let's just put this person right here. He's not very tall though. Sad. But... You can move this and we could put the dog toys underneath by here. I think we need a taller person. 
maybe this one. Yeah, this one's much, much taller. You won't put a dog on the chart, like the toys, of course. Why would you do that if you were wondering? And if the pet, well, the dog is like a baby, you could have this little, little pet food treat. Actually, no, I think that's going to be the vet so then they can feed the animals. Let's put that back there. But then we got milk for the younger ones. I think we'll put all the items up here. And then a basket by here. Um, this chest I had these brushes. One's like a proper vet brush. So you try like this. And then some combs, which people can also buy for their pet. And let's put that upstairs. I'm going to shut the window. Okay, I think we've got this pretty well done. But a vet man will be perfect. You can open the door. And those are meant to be like seat belts. Because um, this person actually came from a vet set. So this vehicle... This person, this bed, um, and a few other things I've got are actually, um, from the same make as this house. Also, like, this is, this is sort of like a dog bed. I'm not sure what this actually is. Actually, no, this is Shopkins. Never mind. I don't even know what it is, but I do have another one, and they connect together, but I don't really know what they do. Um, an example is of the seatbelt in this van. It's like wheel. Um, push this round. You sit the person you want in, and you put it around here, and it'll keep her safe. And it even has like the little marks on the car for buttons and stuff. This is where she puts her feet. The steering wheel over there. Shut the door. The wheels move. And you can open the back to put the pet in. And by here. So we definitely need that. Let's take the woman out though. Um, stand it back up again and put it behind the counter. Now it's full of places some dogs. Okay, I've got a few dogs. I think I know where some of them are going to go already. For this one, small, very small. See how cute it is. It can go in this bed. Um... This little Yorkshire Terrier can go in there. So I think, I think I'm looking more for like sat down dogs. We're lying down like this one. Just put her in there. And then this sat down dog could go maybe in there. Actually, let's take this one out. Put the Yorkshire Terrier in there. And put this dog in there. I found this adorable tiny puppy. Which I actually think I'm going to put this in here again. And then put this little tiny one. I swap them the be beds. Like this. That looks cute. And now I'm going to role play with it. Customer is coming. Hello, I'm coming. I'm coming here to buy a dog. Okay, have a look around. 
Okay, thank you. Oh, wow, there's a big puppy. They stroke it. Woof, woof. Good girl. Just go over here. Oh, look, there's a Yorkshire Terrier. I was looking for a dog. Um, that's small. I know Yorkshire is tiny. Oh, that's a St. Bernard. Mm, too big. Oh. Um, maybe let's go up on here. Thank you. Oh look, it's got, I've got some pet items here. Hmm, that looks cool. Oh, this one's cute. And this one. These are the two smallest dogs in the shop, I think. Hmm, I like that little um, patchy one. <laughs> okay, let's buy you some stuff. I don't think you're a puppy. So, I'll get you. But I, we still need to comb you. So a brush. And some toys. Ruff, ruff. Okay, that seems good. Come on, dog, let's go downstairs. Hello, I've, I've picked my dog. Um, cool. Um, would you like to put your items here? Since you bought a dog, you get a free bag of pet food. Oh, thank you. So, uh, these items are in total of, um, six pounds. And how much will the dog cost? Well, dogs here are free because dogs really need a home. Oh, thank you. If you'd like to buy another dog, you can come any time you want. Thank you. May I take this basket? Yeah. Put them into your, load it into your car and return the basket, please. Okay. Come on, you dog. Let's go. Okay, doggy, that's my car. I'm just going to empty some things into the boot. And let me just go right in the basket really quick. I'll hop in the front. And let me open the door so you can get in as well. Perfect. Now let's drive home. And that's what a role play would sort of go like in this pet shop. Um, this video has been quite long, so I think I have to go now. Please watch my other YouTube videos, and goodbye.